Okay, in today's video, I'm going to be showing off a brand new emulator, the Big, uh, I think it's Big M e, uh, emulator. Um, it's for the Atari Jaguar, and uh, this kind of came out of left field. Um, so what I did is I just kind of went in and I made a module for it, so it basically just launches uh, through Hyperspin. Um, I can launch one here, but I just want to kind of show off. Uh, hyperspin directly so we'll just go in and launch a game I actually haven't done the controls for this yet I'm gonna do this soon after I'm just a little bit excited because I've I've got a new module for this um, which I don't think anybody's actually done yet so this can be completely integrated into the uh, into the um, setup so let's go down to the Atari Jaguar and we'll just launch a game. Uh, we'll, we'll try to pick a game that ran slow with the RetroArch Core, just to kind of show off, uh, you know, the differences between the two. Uh, it should be here. Yeah, it's Harry Jaguar. So. Going in. And, um. Let's do Atari Karts. Because this game ran pretty slowly uh, with the other one. But uh, as you can even see, um, even the spinning of the cubes faster, which is amazing. Um, I don't think I have any of the buttons configured yet. I think it's ASD. Oh yeah, there it goes. Uh, I can create some auto hotkey functions to kind of uh, move around the buttons to where they kind of should be. What's uh? Oh, here we go. Yes, yeah, let's go here. But um, yeah, look at the smoothness on this. Um, the other one didn't run nearly as fast, and the frame rates on this are absolutely perfect. So, I mean, it just kind of shows uh, the amount of work that this guy has uh, put into this. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm just going to get out. Yeah, I just wanted to kind of show that off. Um, this is probably my second video in a few days. I was just a little bit excited that I got to, to put together a, a module for this. Um, Anyway, um, thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next video. Oh, and for anybody that um, wants the update to this and, and they already have a drive, just run the root update. Thanks. All right, bye.